Tor Alva, one of the world's tallest 3D printed structures, was unveiled in the small Swiss village of Moulins on Wednesday, May 21st, meaning White Tower in the Swiss regional language of Romanche. The nearly 30 meter high White Concrete Tower, a collaboration between ETH Zurich and the Origin Cultural Foundation, showcases advanced digital construction techniques. They say it is the world's tallest 3D printed tower. Designed to serve as a cultural hub, the tower aims to revitalize the village, which is home to just 11 residents and faces depopulation. I'm Walter Kaufmann, a professor of structural engineering at ETH Zurich and the chair of concrete structures and bridge design. Toralva is a 30 meter tall 3D printed uh, concrete tower in the small village of uh, Moulins uh, on the Julier Pass near St. Moritz in Switzerland. Uh, that tower is actually a multi story building, four stories. Uh, consists of uh, the respective floors and 32 3D printed concrete columns. The structure, built without traditional formwork, features 32 sculptured concrete columns created through robotic additive manufacturing or 3D printing. A novel concrete mixture and a new reinforcement method developed by ETH researchers enable the tower's load-bearing capacity. The design, resembling an ornate layered cake, pays homage to the region's history of confectioners. That we really managed to integrate the reinforcement in the 3D printed concrete uh, such that it actually works like conventional reinforced concrete, although by by its nature, it's quite different. On the uh, material side, it's the mix that we're using, which is a three component mix where we add uh, a viscosity enhancer and an accelerator to the pumped mortar only at the nozzle. So the viscosity enhancer keeping the concrete from flowing just down and the accelerator ensuring sufficient strength buildup until the printhead uh, returns and then also for the subsequent layers of concrete so that the structure doesn't collapse. And the third is on the robotic level where we managed to achieve a fully robotic integration of the transverse interlayer reinforcement during the print process. So collaboration of the printing robot with the reinforcement placing robot. I think that's the three main innovations. The developers say the project highlights innovative construction and aims to boost sustainable tourism in the region. So, so to ensure that the tower can be uh, dismounted and reassembled, it consists of uh, several pieces which are similar to prefabricated concrete actually, uh, which are then brought to site and bolted together uh, with uh, bolts that you could actually uh, tighten to, to uh, fix it and then also just loosen and uh, take the pieces apart. Tor Alva, located at the Julia Pass near St. Moritz, will open for guided tours on May 23rd. The tower is set to remain in Moulins for five years before potential relocation. Yeah, the process is, is scalable. I'm a bit skeptical whether it will bring it to construction site. And if you cannot bring, just because of the robustness of the process with the harsh conditions that you will encounter in uh, most construction sites, so it will be scalable to the point uh, similar as prefabricated elements are. And then these components will be assembled uh, on site. 